Morning, everyone. I hope you're all well. Welcome to another yoga session with me, Clemmy. We're going to do a little bit of dynamic yoga this morning, which means we're going to be moving our bodies quite a bit and using quite a bit of energy. And hopefully by the end, you'll be feeling really good. So let's get going. Okay. Find a comfortable position on the floor. Hopefully you've all got a mat or something like that, or you might be on the carpet, but just make sure you're comfortable. Drop your shoulders down. Take a few deep breaths. And one more. There, feels better already. Okay, I'd like everyone to come down to lying on their backs, please. So lying right down on your back, like this. And just wrap your arms around your legs and squeeze them in. Give yourself a nice tight squeeze. With your knees pulled in towards your chest, just start to rock very gently from side to side. We don't want to rock too far over or we might come all the way over onto the side. We're just rocking so that our lower back gets a little massage. Super. Okay. We're then going to stretch out, hands and legs stretching right out up the mat. And then bring everything back in and rock again from side to side. Lovely. Okay. Now we're going to lift our head up and imagine you're trying to tuck your nose between your knees. This is called cosmic egg. And we're tucking ourselves as small as we can and relaxing back down. And again, lift your head up, tuck your nose between your knees. Don't forget to keep breathing. And relax back down. Lovely. Next, I want everyone to hold on to one knee. I'm holding on to my right knee, but whichever is easier to start with. Hold on to one knee and stretch the other leg right out down the mat. That's it. So one knee is tucked right up towards your chest and the other leg is stretched right out down the mat. Hold this stretch for a few breaths. And then let's swap over. So tuck the other knee in towards your chest and stretch the opposite leg out down the mat. Lovely. Come back to the original knee, swapping over again. But this time, I want you to see if you can lift the stretched out leg a little way off the mat. So just slightly off the mat, your foot is hovering in the air. You have to use strong tummy muscles, holding that leg up off the floor and relax back down. Good job. Okay, let's come to the other side and do the same. So lifting that foot slightly off the floor and holding it, hovering in the air and 
relax it back down. Great. Bring both knees in. Give yourself a big hug and rock from side to side. Lovely. Okay. Next, we're going to come onto our tummies. So spin all the way round and find a way to come onto your tummies. All the way down. There we go. Oh, it's so sunny today. I'm not complaining, but my goodness. That sun's just come round the corner, so I'm going to close the shutters. And then you can see me better. There we go. That's better. Okay, sorry about that. Right, you're lying on the floor. There we are, that's a better angle. You're lying on the floor on your tummy, and your hands are tucked on either side with your elbows tucked in. And all I want you to do is push up so you're resting on your elbows like this. Push up and rest on your elbows. And then we're simply going to look up at the ceiling and down at the floor. Up at the ceiling. And down at the floor. Up at the ceiling. And down at the floor. Up at the ceiling. Stretch, looking up with your eyes as well, and then down at the floor. Good. Come down onto your hands and take a little rest for a moment. Make a little pillow with your two hands and rest your forehead on, the, on your hands. You can even rock your head from side to side, which massages your forehead. It can feel really nice. Then come back onto your elbows. And this time, you're going to look round and see if you can see your feet. So you're looking all the way round, back towards your feet. And then come back to centre. And look all the way round at your other foot. Come back to centre and take another little rest on your hands. You can rock your head from side to side. Okay, lovely. From here, spread your hands for balance and we're all going to push back. Bring your knees forward, sit down on your feet and come into a child's pose. So this one, nice relaxed child's pose. Bring your hands back towards your feet and just rest your forehead down on the mat. Take some nice deep breaths in this position. Imagine you're breathing into your back, expanding this part of your back, sending all the breath here. Lovely relaxing pose. And come up slowly. Take a deep breath and spin round back to sitting in our usual position, legs crossed in a basket. Well done, everyone. I hope you enjoyed that. 
Now we're going to move on to do some side stretches and some forward folds. Okay, so just make sure you're sitting in a nice neutral position, nice straight back. And from here, we're going to take a stretch over to the side. Nice stretch. It's so sunny, my hand has disappeared, but it is there. And come back to center. Coming over to the other side. And back to center. And then just make that, make that movement into a bit of a flow. So we're floating over from one side the other, stretching out the sides of your back, using your tummy muscles to bounce yourself back from one side to the other. Lovely. And come to center. Now let's take a twist. So you're taking one hand onto the opposite knee. So my right hand is on my left knee and my left hand is coming all the way behind me. And then I'm just going to twist myself around like a corkscrew, nice strong back. And I'm looking directly behind myself Don't forget to breathe, particularly in these twists, it's really important. Nice, strong breaths. And come back to center, good. And then we'll go the other way. So my left hand is coming onto my right knee and my right hand is coming all the way behind me, resting on the floor. And I'm going to take that twist around the other way now and look behind myself. And back to center. Oh, I love that twist. It feels so nice. It's really good for all the organs that are in this part of your body. So your kidneys and your liver gives them all a nice stretch. It's a really, really lovely thing to do. Okay, well done, everybody. We're going to do a little bit of forward folding. And then I think that'll be finished for this session. Time flies. Okay. Stretch your legs out in front of you, go straight legs. In fact, I'm gonna go this way because you can probably see what I'm doing better if I'm that way. Yeah, okay. So legs down the mat, strong legs, pushing your knees down into the mat so you get a nice, strong, straight leg. Toes pointing up towards the ceiling and heels just possibly lifted off the floor. Just like that, okay? And then from here, we're going to take a big breath in and sweep our hands up towards the ceiling. And then as you breathe out, I want you to make the om sound and come all the way down towards your toes. So we're breathing in and breathing out. Om. The louder, the better. It's a lovely way to get that breath going, that lovely exhale. Let's try again. Big breath in. Oh. Really take your time with it. 
see how long you can make the on sound for. And again, big breath in, sweep the hands up and fold forward. Om. Rest in this position for a few breaths. And slowly come up to sitting. Okay, I'm going to spin back round to the front now. And let's all find our cross leg position. Let's take a few nice cleansing breaths just to bring the energy back down. So inhaling hands above your head. Exhaling hands down towards your heart centre. Again, inhaling up, exhaling down. Inhaling up, exhaling down. Well done, everybody. Okay, let's do our poem. Bring your hands here. In front of your heart center. I am love. I am light. I am joy. And I am peace. There is a beautiful light inside my heart that was given to me when I was born. And because of that light, I'm not afraid of anyone or anything. Om Shanti, which means peace everywhere. I hope you all have a lovely week and I'll catch up with you again next week. Take care until then. Bye, everyone. Bye.